and welcome to This Is Steam. It's got some comments on it. <laughs> Have you ever been shopping for a new game and, you know, say, oh, I wonder what my peers think of this game? No, I don't do and that. And then you go and read the comments and you go, I don't know what I just read. We're going to read those uh, comments and we're going to try and guess, I think. Right, Kinsey? Yeah, you're going to try to guess what game it could be. Here's Open-ended. I have a secret. Got my secret mad angle oh my over God. here. Austin and I... Are gonna, we're gonna get zero right. Here's the thing. This game is gonna mm. entirely rely on Kenzie's kindness and her generosity to giving us some hints Have to- you met Kenzie? The only one more like goblin than I am is Kenzie. I think Kenzie's gonna be very kind mm -mm. and helpful mm -mm. today and giving us lots of hints. All Shall right. we start with number one? Not recommended. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. You can't even start there. 385.3 hours on record. You have to mention how many I hours. Was, uh, I was reading linearly. <laughs> Zero out of 10. I have no real life relationship because all I care about is monkey. <laughs> Something else to note. 384.2 hours at review time, but they only put one more hour in before they gave up the game. Yeah. So they, this is like a parting goodbye review to the game that they spent a lot of hours at. 385 hours is a lot I of hours. I know exactly what this I game do too, is. actually. What is it? I think it's Super Monkey Ball. No, it is Bloons Tower Defense 6. What? Really? Yep. <laughs> Bloons TD 6. Kenzie gave this one the, to Matt. The reason this I one, say I don't mm. game is because all I play is Bloons Tower Defense. Do you think you're 385 hours then? Oh, I'm way more than that. So Matt automatically I'm, wins this game because we are not going to get any of the other ones correct. <laughs> you, you keep talking us down. I have confidence. Austin doesn't play Stop games. using the secret mat <laughs> angle. It's not secret if you use it three times in the first five seconds of the video. Moving on. Not recommended. 5.8 hours on record. This game explains how the government covered up multiple assassination attempts. Oh boy. Oh, okay. Goat simulator. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, what? Okay. Oh, wait, what about papers, please? Papers, please. Ooh, Everyone knows. I don't even know that one. That's about like where you're supposed to just stamp passports and yeah, leave it You're like a border guard in like yeah. a Soviet state checking people's passports. Uh, mm. Okay, okay. I, I feel like it's got to be some like 1970s CIA like Far Cry or Call of Duty. It's got to be something like not that. Bad. I'm just going to go the safe bet and say it's an Assassin's Creed game. I would say that uh, these answers are sus. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, oh, what? What? <laughs> the government's assassination attempts? This is the government assassin. Actually, you know what? Wait a minute. Hold on. Think about it. If you were training to be a government assassin, how better would you learn subterfuge, espionage, and outright deception other than by practicing for 5.8 hours in Among Us? This is actually a very good answer. I mean, we're totally wrong, but um, I checks out. I, I have a side note. Stop over using here. the angle. Oh uh, we're recording. What makes this even more sus is we're recording this on the anniversary of JFK assassination. Moving on. <laughs> I played so long, the game is now real. I'm being hunted by five alternate versions of me, all intent on killing me. I'm hiding out in the sixth multiverse, and I can only hope they don't track me here. I'm running uh, out of places to hide. My first thought is immediately death. But I think that's too obvious. I think that's too on the nose. This is going to be like Pokemon or something. <laughs> well, I've included another review in case that's oh, not Oh, you have a second review for this one. I broke the game with too many horse. Okay, well, that, that that throws my guess out. <laughs> so what's a game you can have too many horses with? Is it like Civ, maybe? Civ is the oh. only other game I play. So. Wait, Red Dead? Red Dead? You could have too many horses in Red Dead, and you could get so deep into the multiverse of 1903 Wild West. What's an old game with horses? Wait. Oregon Wait, Trail? Oregon Trail? Is it really? With alternate dimensions? Oh, yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> I'm going with Oregon Trail, so. All right. I, I, I'm going to go with any of my guesses because they're all wrong. 5D <laughs> chess with multiverse time travel? You know what? Too many horses, actually. That's too, a good, yeah, too that's many a good one. That's a good too one. Too many horses. Yep. A wins. Ooh, woo. E wee. I'm just going to go purely on XCOM because I have nothing. Oh, XCOM's a that's really That's the first good Aliens answer. game I think of. I mean, I would think. Alien, uh, alien predator. Yeah, that's uh, another good one. Or isolation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but that's only one alien. Also, ooh, aliens. Like, yeah. are, are these like cute aliens? <laughs> She's throwing yeah, this up no, right no, now. No, like, there's no. Oh my god. There's deception afoot. I would have said Among Us for this one. Mm. And I'm gonna, you know what? Screw it. I'm gonna say Among Us. Are Among Us canonically people? No, they have a bone in them. Oh, that's a good point. And they have floating hands. Yeah, yeah, I forgot about that. Part. What? I'm gonna stick with XCOM. I'm, I'm just gonna go with XCOM. My first gut. Oh! Alien, okay, okay. 
Okay. That was well played. That was well played. I, like, do I get the point? Because I dead. Yes. De okay. You said the words alien isolation. Okay. That's got to be worthy of All the right. point. Who <laughs> woo after who's, alien who's isolation? <laughs> yeah, I didn't see Sigourney going, ooh woo. And then. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. There's a bunch of stuff right. here. Okay. Weaponized GoPro travels to hell to stop Discord mods from posting cringe. <laughs> okay. That's not helpful at all. <laughs> what? Doom? You know what this game is doing? It is laying bare our lack, our deep, this is showing canonical how lack much of knowledge. How much we are gamers that compromise. Again, if you threw balloons at me, I got that immediately. Which to be fair, Kenzie did throw balloons at you. I was a little bit of a gimme, I'm just gonna say. Well, sorry, sorry they, you know, they no one has fun things to say about F1. So, <laughs> trying to think of the, um, the one that, that just came out. It's like Doom, but it's like a puzzle game. I can't remember the name of it now. People are like, are gonna be watching this screaming at it. Yeah. Ultra, Ultra Kill. Kill. Okay. Oh. Not what I was thinking of. You know what? I've actually never played this. That checks out. I have nothing to say. No, I, 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 <laughs> it is I like, it's, it's, it's heavily Doom inspired and it's very popular among like people who write weird posts. <laughs> I think I get a half point for that one. I was in the right genre. Yeah, yeah I'll, I'll give you, that I'll, to you. Uh, yeah, I'll give it to you. Someone tell me what game I'm thinking of. Let comments. Matt know in the comments below. Because I'm, I feel like I'm having um, a, a stroke over here, because I can't remember this game. All right, moving on. Recommended zero hours in the last two weeks. Poser alert. Yeah, my hands have become numb and shattered. My sanity is gone, primordial, and I have returned to monkey. Rip my bedroom walls. Oh God. Oh. Cookie clicker. Cookie clicker. Cookie clicker. That's a good answer, Cookie actually. Cookie clicker. Sure. Cookie clicker. Gorilla, Gorilla tag. tag. What? Oh my god. Okay. This is a VR game where yeah. you can only run using your hands. Yeah, I was never no, gonna get this no. one. Uh, I don't wanna look at that monkey anymore. Embrace your inner ape. I would prefer not to. This is not selling me this game. I'm not tagging no gorillas, my friend. I think mm. that's illegal, actually. Playable version of McDonald's <laughs> Sprite. I love that. Mm. So crispy, crispy, clear, wonderful, delightful. Pure joy. League of Legends. <laughs> and everyone thinks this is hilarious. It's gotta be a pretty popular this game. This is a weird game, by the way. Oh, so no, man, not we're weird. We're not gonna get these. Look, if the game doesn't have Phil Spencer on stage talking about it, I don't know what it is. Cookie clicker. Sure, I, I have no idea. Post, Post Void. void. <laughs> Guys, are you okay? No, are whoever you? made this game is not okay. Post Void is a hypnotic scramble of early first person shooter design that values speed above all else. Why would you think we get, would get this? I didn't. Uh, oh, okay, well that's fair. Six out of these should have been balloons. I don't think that's actually true. In my time playing, oh, no. I have bred some morbid exclusions of God's holy light, but nothing comes close to my pinnacle of life, my Magnus Opus. His name is Steve. Steve is built like an absolute tank. He has no legs and a blue cursed face that not even the most desperate of mothers could endear. When I say Steve was wide, I mean it. Steve could single-handedly replace all known structures in the world with no repercussions, unless we're talking about traumatizing the entire population of humanity. If there is a God, he is left because of Steve. 15 out of 10. Okay, I think I have an answer for I this. have an answer too. It's an old school game. I, Spore. Ah, oh, that's what I was gonna say. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna say Spore. Just like the fact that he has no legs and a blue yeah, cursed face. Yeah. I mean, for a second I was thinking Sims. Like, oh, like, like but, someone created nah, like, but like but yeah, Spore. I was, I would have said Spore. Yeah. Let me introduce you to Wobble Dogs. <laughs> what? <laughs> A 3D pet simulation where you raise your own personal hive of mutating dog. I thought Spore was a good Spore guess. Spore was a great I, I, Spore I, was a good guess. We get I, let's give those points for that one. We get points for that. We remember yeah. games from 2010 because we 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 decided to not choose violence. But yep. By playing Wobble Dogs? This game reminds me of sneaking to the fridge at 3 a.m. to eat shredded cheese out of the bag while my dad roams the house. Ooh. Okay. So right. that's the best part about shredded being an adult living alone bag. is I don't have to sneak Ooh. to get my shredded cheese. Dude, fridge. I can use some shredded cheese right now. I can get down with that. Maybe like some kind of like a uh, stealthy game you're trying to like hide or something. How literally should we take my, while my dad roams the house? Like maybe you're like, to me I, it's just I, like. I'm taking that literally. I have a very out there answer and I don't think it's right, but I, I think it fits into this. 
I'm gonna say Resident Evil Village. That's a bold move, my or friend. Or I guess any Resident Evil. There's sure. Usually, there's usually one boss that just kind of vaguely follows you around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. in Village, I'm thinking of the Big Mommy big, uh, vampire. Big Mommy Milk. Yeah. yeah. Oh. I, I didn't say <laughs> that. Sorry. I just, sorry. If we're gonna I, get canceled, uh, play, talk to uh, him. Sorry. Uh, if I, I do think it's Big Mommy. Like PT, you get to like walk around the house or something. But clearly, that, there's no Steam reviews for PT. No. It's Outlast. Outlast, Outlast is a good oh, one. Okay. Okay. All right. We were both vaguely in the You're vicinity. Pretty close. You're yeah. Pretty, yeah. 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 Oh, good lord. This is a weird looking dog. That's the whole review. That's a weird looking dog. There's like nothing to go on except that this is a very funny review, apparently. Yeah. Only two hours as well. I'm assuming it's a dog like on the cover of a game. But right? like, I don't think it's a dog. I think like. Yeah, of course, of course. Yeah. I was yeah. gonna say like Goat Simulator. Yeah, that's a great answer. I'll 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 back you up on that. Goat simulator. I'm locking in goat simulator as okay. my actual answer. Okay. But can I give my sub answer, which won't count if I get it? Sure. I'm gonna go with Elden Ring. I'm gonna say it's gonna be yeah like Horizon. Oh, straight. straight. Oh, we could have got that one. How could I forget that one? What? Wait, it's a weird looking dog. What? Because they're saying that the cat is a dog. I don't. I feel like but it's, I, it's a cat actually. I don't get it. Yeah, that's the joke. I don't get it. Well, then there is Explain no to me then. You. Explain how a cat and I dog did. is the same thing. It's a weird dog. It's not if a normal dog. It's it. a it's weird It's not one. a dog. It's a cat. That's the joke. We're not saying it's a good joke, but we're saying that. 3,000 people said that's a good joke. 3,000 people think this is a hilarious joke, and they and think it's a good joke. And these people are reading reviews on Steam. Good point. Never mind. A modern day version of Dante's Inferno, where you pilot a damned soul through the levels of hell, clawing and fighting through a sick and twisted game in which 60 attempt to escape the fiery pit of hell, while the others who fail are cast back into the lake of fire and burn for the rest of eternity. Uh, this is Fall Guys. Fall this is Fall Guys. guys. This is Fall Guys. I actually feel relatively good that this is Fall Guys. I was gonna say, um, uh, Hades. Oh, that's not bad. That's not uh, bad. It's fun, guys. Fall yeah, guys. Yeah, yeah, let's yeah. go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm let's giving, go. I'm giving Austin let's all go. the points on that one. Let's go. You, you stay let's you go. Stay out of I'm pretty proud of that one. I did. Yeah, yeah. No, you, you got that one. Remake of a masterpiece. Immerses you in the fictional world of Nevada. I have two strong guesses for this one. It's got to be New Vegas. It's New Vegas or American Truck Simulator. It's one of those two. Oh. I'm very confident. New Vegas or Truck Simulator. I feel very confident in one of those two. I'm going with New Vegas. I'll go Truck Simulator then. Desert, Desert Bus VR. Bus. Oh, <gasps> remake. No, no. I, remake. I was going to say yeah. Desert Bus. This is a good one. This is an excellent game because I was so confident. What yeah, it is. Game? It is. I'm so mad right now. Bruh. This game ruined my life because I got the hots for John. And so my wife made me choose between John or the kids. So now I'm divorced. I give this game one out of 10. I still love you, John. Who is John? I mean, there's... John Marston from Red Dead? John Snow from the Telltale Game of Thrones game? John, like, Halo John? John, John Halo. John C. Halo. John C. Halo. Uh, John. I think Red Dead is a really good uh, mm -hmm. guess because who didn't fall in love with John? But I'm going to go with, uh, what is it? The, um, Boyfriend Dungeon. I'm going to say Red Dead. I don't know. Whoa! <laughs> Garfield Kart Furious Racing. <laughs> We're gonna leave the number here for professional help. <laughs> um, if you just dial 4222 hashtag three. You uh, get no help. You deserve no help. Guys! <laughs> I, that, I will say though, that is probably the funniest review we've read yeah. this entire show. Greek salad for gamers. It contains a lot of vitamins. Four large vine tomatoes cut into irregular wedges. Wait. One cucumber peeled, deceded, and then roughly chopped. This is, this is... One half red onion, thinly sliced. Okay, wait, wait, we get the idea. Yes, it's, pepper, a, it's ingredients sliced. for a Greek salad. 16 oh. kalamata olives. One tablespoon dried oregano. Or nor Greek salad dressing. That's that's key if you're on a diet. I'm just gonna say overcooked because that's the only like cooking thing. Co cookie cutter. This is a cookie weird clicker. one. A cookie clicker. No. <laughs> cookie clicker. You're way overthinking this because this is not gonna be. This is not gonna have anything to do with sure. Food. Sure. That's my answer. Yeah, it is uh, The Witcher 3. Yeah. But also know that this guy put this on like 20 other games. He really wants the gamers to be healthy. Like, get those nutrients. You know what? Touch grass. The moral of the story. Steam games not good. Playing video games, terrible. Eat salads, touch grass, and never, ever, ever let that dude near John. <laughs> like, subscribe, follow us, and tell us in the comments how we should have gotten every one of these right and you knew all of them right off the get-go. Because he probably did, because we suck. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.